The public organization for promoting the Gaelic language must make significant improvements, according to a critical report by the Auditor General for Scotland. Caroline Gardner has raised several concerns about the management of Bordnar Gaelic, from ineffective leadership to poor relationships and organizational culture. Created in 2005, its role is to promote the use of Gaelic across Scotland and to advise the Scottish government about issues relating to the language. The Inverness-based board employs 19 staff and is funded by Scottish Government grants, with a net expenditure in the last year of £5.3 million. In her report looking into the organisation's governance, Ms Gardner said, Gaelic is an important part of Scotland's culture. But all public bodies, irrespective of their size, must demonstrate clear and effective governance and make key decisions in an open and transparent way. The board's leadership team and board must deliver significant improvements in the issues raised to establish the trust and confidence of staff and stakeholders, including the parliament and the public. Warning of a lack of confidence and a culture of mistrust throughout the organization because of the lack of leadership, the report also expressed concern that all board and committee meetings were held in private, indicating a wider problem of a lack of openness and transparency in decision-making. Responding to the report, the convener of the Scottish Parliament's Public Audit Committee Jenny Mara said, Time and again we hear of poor leadership and poor governance in public bodies, and Board Nargalic is no different according to Audit Scotland. If Board Nargalic is to succeed in its mission to safeguard and promote the Gaelic language then substantive improvement will be required. The Public Audit Committee will want a clear understanding of how they got to this point and how they plan to turn it around. For more on this story, visit the news article link.